Hello, welcome to Tejas Education. Let's learn about sugar industry. India stands in the second spot, the production of sugar, but we stand in the first place, the production of jaggery and khandasari. What is jaggery or gur? This is the picture of jaggery. You will find this inside the kitchen cabinet, most of the Indian household. It is an excellent replacement to regular sugar, which is healthier. And then comes Kandasari. Kandasari is also a raw, unprocessed sugar, which is formed from sugarcane juice. Sugarcane juice is boiled. Later, it turns into thick jaggery syrup. From that syrup, the sugar crystals are separated with the help of centrifugal machine. Next point is very important in exam point of view. The raw material used in this industry is bulky and in haulage, sucrose content reduces. Sugar mills, 662 in number. States where we can locate this industry, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar, Maharashtra, Karnataka, Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, Gujarat, Punjab, Haryana and Madhya Pradesh. This can be asked as a map question. You have to locate them in Indian map. Where should the sugar mill be ideally located? Sugar mill should be located close to sugarcane farm or field as it's bulky. The sucrose content will reduce if it is stored for long time. 60 percentage of mills are located in Uttar Pradesh and Bihar in India. Industry is seasonal as raw material is seasonal, industry is also seasonal. It is suited for cooperative sector. We will learn about cooperative sector in this video. Please watch this video till the end. In recent years, there is a tendency for the mills to shift and concentrate in the southern and western state, especially Maharashtra. This is an important question. This is because the cane produced here has higher sucrose content and cooler climate ensures longer crushing season. Why do they crush? To get sugar cane juice, whereby they produce sugar. We learned Khandasari. Cooperatives are more successful in these states. Why cooperative sector is ideally suited for sugar industry? Let's learn what is a cooperative sector. Cooperative sector is a business organization run by sugarcane farmers and raw material supplier. At times it is individually done and sometimes they are doing it together. This saves them from borrowing money when there is no work in sugarcane farm. Example, sugarcane industry of Maharashtra. Now let's go back to a question. Why cooperative sector is ideally suited for sugar industry? Sugarcane is seasonal. The farmers would be left without job and to avoid financial constraint on the farmers, the cooperative sector is the best option. What are the challenges faced by sugar industry? Seasonal nature of the industry as the raw material is seasonal, industry's nature is also seasonal because it's entirely dependent on its raw material. Old and inefficient methods of production. The technology has to be adapted. Machinery has to be updated. Transport delay in reaching cane to factories. As we know that if the haulage is more, sucrose content comes down and the quality of sugar will be low. The need to maximize the use of bagasse. Bagasse is the residual matter left out after crushing of sugarcane. The sugarcane is crushed to get juice. Bagasse is also an important Biofuel used to produce heat and electricity in sugar mill. So thanks for watching sugar industry video. All the best for your upcoming exam. Please do like, subscribe and share Tejas Education.
do consider subscribing. Thanks again. All the best.